Hello everyone, thank you for joining me today. My name is Greg and I'm an adventurous eater. Let's see if the food I tried today will snack. All right, I have another comparison video today. And this isn't really comparing. What we're gonna do today is decide if Lay's should produce either of these as a regular run chip. These are their limited edition, like they do, where people suggest flavors for Lay's to do. These are two of my favorite sandwiches. I love BLTs, I love Cuban sandwiches. So I hope they did them well, and we'll see if I think they should make these all the time. So let's see, which one should I try first? I think I'm gonna go, hmm, Cuban. All right, let's tear them open. Now we've got the wavy variety on the Cuban sandwich. Just regular wavy lays. Doesn't seem to have a whole lot of flavor powdering on it. Instant taste of mustard and pickle. Don't really taste any ham. It just tastes more like mustard and pickle. Maybe a little bit of cheese, but I don't really taste the ham. And it's just, it's not as much of a punch of flavor as I'd want. Like it's good, but I feel like it should have more. But let's see how they did with the bacon. Ooh. So these have some nice coating of spices on them. Regular classic Lay's. Mm. Oh yeah, you taste the bacon. And it even feels like there's mayo in there. Like I can totally taste that like fatty, like oily mayo kind of flavor. Hint on the tomato, maybe, maybe a little bit. Let me try another one. Oh man, that is a seriously good chip. This 100% I would buy all the time from Lay's. This one is totally worth doing year round. Cuban sandwich is good. I don't think it's worth doing year round. It just doesn't quite work because there's no ham flavor. They didn't they didn't win it with that one. But the bacon's totally there, the mayo's there. Oh, and that tomato's got just the nice little hint in there. These are excellent snacks. I really, really, really enjoy BLT. So, um, Lay's, please make these year round. Totally worth it. And also bring back the uh, the smoked gouda ones that you did. Those kettle chips they were excellent. But uh, if you enjoyed this video, give the like button a click. If you have any suggestions for any other snacks you want to see me try in the series, leave it in the comments. I'll be happy to try them if I can find them.